Hi guys, Stan's Dollars here. It's episode 10 of the £50 in 50p coin hunt book 2. The aim of the game is to collect every different commemorative 50p in UK circulation. 63 different ones in total at the moment. Let's see if we can try and find them all. So these are all the ones that we've managed to find so far for book 2. We are just missing the Olympic wrestling one out of book 1. So if we do stumble across that one, then we will put that in the first book. That one will be completed and then we can fully concentrate on this one. So five bags in total, £10 in each bag, and like I say, hopefully we can try and find something to add to the collection. Hope you've all had a really nice day so far, whether you've just got back from work or just about to go to work. It might be a day off, you might be on lockdown, and I hope you've all had a really nice day regardless. So no luck with the first bag. If you do have any questions, get them on this video, because the question answers video is going up in about 30 minutes time. I've got a few more on there from the previous video, so if there is any more questions, get them in quickly. A huge shout out to Bill Mason as well for hitting that join button. Incredible, that's three people in three days now that have hit that join button. Absolutely amazing and I can't thank you all enough. The leaderboard for the top commenter of the week. The first of two updated leaderboards throughout the week will be going up around 10pm tonight so you can see how you're getting on. If you are new to the top commenter, three points for the first comment on any of my videos, two for second and one for third. All the points get added up from Monday until Saturday midnight. Sundays don't count because it's prize giving day. The person with the most points throughout the whole week will become the top commenter of the week and will win the overall prize. As long as you've scored one point throughout the whole week, your name will be put on the list. All the names on the list are going to bowl and two lucky winners will be drawn at random for additional prizes on prize giving day. So in this bag here, we've just picked up two coins. The Sir Roger Bannister 2004 and also the Victoria Cross 2006, that one there, the medal. And I don't think we actually have either of them either so far in the book, which is great news. Two more additions. I did just do two lots of £50 before this video, nothing in any of them. So it's nice to get a couple of this one, especially so we can get a video up there for you guys as well. So we're on to the last bag. Again, from me, a huge shout out to everyone that's subscribing. We've nearly hit 100 subscribers. Just as I'm saying that, it was a 2011. You can never be sure. And there it is. I wouldn't say it's the best quality one. This one does have quite a lot of scar in there on the front. But this one here, the Olympic Athletics 50p. The second Olympic one we've got so far. And that one actually definitely got me off guard there. I was thinking 2011, what do you normally get for them? I was thinking WWF and only have a good run for them. But no, it's another Olympic. And it really does make up for all of the times that I do make the videos and don't get them. And like I say, there is a lot of them. I don't upload them just because I don't really want you lot to sit through four or five minutes of just finding shields. So, three in total. You all know what the star find is. It's the Olympic Athletics. Just before I got really excited with there, I was going to say we've just hit 100 subscribers in just over four days. And it really is incredible and I can't thank you all enough. So that one there was definitely the star find. I hope it brings you luck in your coin hunts. Hope you've all had a really nice day. Good luck coin hunting. And as always, thanks for watching.